the Coach Sydney Satchel, is it worth it? Hello everyone, welcome back to another mommy review where I review all things for the love of. Today I'm checking out the Sydney Satchel from Coach and doing a full review on it. So let's head over to the Coach outlet store and have a look at it. Was it worth it? Well, before I start, if you like the content on the channel, please consider giving this video a thumbs up and consider subscribing to the channel. It'll really help a lot. Thank you so much for considering and on with the video. So the Sydney Satchel is a top handle bag that also has a strap that comes with it. I think it's such a versatile bag, so I figure I'll head over to the store and have a look. Now, I know that some of you may not have access to a Coach Outlet store near you, so hopefully these videos are helpful so you can have a up and personal look at some of these beautiful bags that I've recently been scouting out at Coach. So here in the signature canva is the Sydney Satchel. I think it is a very classy bag, very classic look. You can see there is a zipper opening and a shoulder strap on the inside. I think that the Signature Canva is a beautiful bag. It's currently on sale for $169. There is a black version, very classy as well. I'm not sure why the bag looks a little bit lumpy here on camera. Makes me a little bit put off from it. But you can see that the zipper does go all the way down near the bottom. So it makes it easier for you to open up the bag and actually physically find your belongings inside. I believe the lining inside is black. So it's kind of like a pitch black bag inside might be hard to find your things because of the color scheme oh i'm wrong it's actually like a darker brown color on the inside anyways so i think it looks really cute and really fancy perfect for going out to dinner it kind of fits all the things nicely and it's like a smaller bag i'm personally leaning towards a chalk color this one doesn't have feet on the bottom but i think it's just so darn cute i makes me a little bit more mindful about everything I'm purchasing lately given that there are so many versions of cute bags I'm seeing at Coach. This one of the chalk color is actually really popular in the store. There aren't too many left whereas the black and the Canva version there are many different ones left on the shelf. So I think this is probably the more popular color and like probably um, easy to go with for, with various wardrobe for both winter and also summer. So as I'm more mindful about what bags I'm getting, I'm thinking about like, is this an essential bag I need in my closet? I do find that it's very casual and it does elevate your look a little bit more. It's very spacious on the inside for a small bag and I love the color tones available for it. I think because of the shape of the bag, it allows you to store a little bit more than you would think and it can be worn day to night. I think it looks really cute as a top handle bag, but you can see the strap is adjustable. That's one thing I wanted to double check on. So yeah, this chalk color is definitely the one I would lean towards if I was to pick up one of these Sydney Satchel bags, which I'm pre pretty sure I'm still on the fence about right now. I would love to know if you have a version of this bag, whether um, you like the bag, how do you find it functionally and where and so forth. But I can see why this one is so popular. I think it's a very classic shape and will it's not super fancy, no bells and whistle and will probably stand the test of time. So next, I wanna head over to the website to show you and so you can see a comparison between how it looks like on the website and how it looks like in store. Cause I know that it looks fairly different sometimes. So hopefully this is helpful. So the Sydney Satchel, in the signature canva and also just like the classic colorways it's currently on sale for 169 dollars so here on the website you can see that it's 52 percent off this is the black version of the gold that we saw earlier it looks really structured in the store but one thing to watch out for if you're purchasing this bag online and arriving on it in your store step is just to check it's like flat and lumpy on the front because I'm noticing that in some of the outlet bags. But the gold hardware looks beautiful. You can see how the zipper goes all the way down. I think one of the cons related to it is that it's only one zipper that has two poles. It would be really nice if it had an open close on either side of the bag. So you can see it's only one zipper. But it does open generously inside. I think 
Maybe now that I'm looking at it, does it look a little bit toyish as a top handle? Not sure. Um, I'll show you how it looks like on the model as a crossbody later on, but I love the strap that comes with it that gives you that option. Again, this is the gold and chalk combination that I am so in love with. I love how the color scheme inside the bag is not like pitch black, so it's easier to, for you to find your belongings. And here you can see like the handle is sticking up. Despite that, it looks really cute as a crossbody, which I'm kind of surprised by because I thought it would look a little bit bulky um, or odd because of the structure of the bag, and the width of the bag. But actually it looks okay on the model. They also have like this heart cherry print version on top of the signature canvas that we saw in the store. I feel like, is it me or does it like looks more of a grandma bag? I'm not really sure, but it does look really cheek on the model. I'd love to hear from you guys. Like, what do you think about the signature canvas from Coach? Or would you go for just like the regular one? They also have this cherry heart one. I think it's just came out. So it's on sale for $175. I think it looks really cute, very youthful. And I love the little red on the zipper, like on top of the chalk. It just adds a, something, a little something, something on top of it. It's really cute. But I think given I'm leaning more towards more mature bag nowadays, this might not be on the top of my list. But I, I think for my younger self, I would probably be interested in this bag. Anyways, thank you so much for joining me on this video in reviewing the Sydney Satchel bag. I would love to hear, is this something a overrated bag or underrated bag? Would you consider this one to add to your collection? Leave a comment below and with that said, take care and stay safe everyone. Bye for now.